sick of love songs I'm tired of this And I wanna taste straight just like it is You're watching me like you want me But you're still holding back still holding Hey guys, back. welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video Today we are going to be spring cleaning my bedroom and also our bathroom I am just getting started by taking down all of the curtains in my bedroom and also the bathroom and getting those in the wash so I can get deep down and really clean this bedroom. Everything was super dusty. Everything really needed like a good wipe down. The windows were gross. The window sills were all yucky. So that is what we are doing today. I hope you guys enjoy cleaning videos. I do lots of cleaning, motherhood, organizing, and minimalist videos here on my channel. So if those are things that interest you, I would love for you to check out my other videos and I would love for you to subscribe. What's the deal? Cause I want you to show me what you feel. You're watching me like you want me, but you're still holding Now I'm just going over all of our woodwork. We have wood on our bed and our nightstand and dressers. And I do use the Method wood cleaner for this just to give the wood a nice shine and clean everything and dust it really well. I typically just use Thieves cleaner for my daily cleaning, but now that I was using this deep clean, I decided to use that cleaner. And now we are vacuuming our lampshades, which were absolutely filthy my lampshades literally changed color after i vacuumed them there was so much matted on dust and whatever else is floating around in the air so this is your reminder to go vacuum out a lampshade in your house because they are probably filled with dust and dirt the lampshades cleaned and everything dusted in the wood all polished I am just going to use this Arm & Hammer like carpet refresh it's basically just baking soda and a little bit of like scent to it 
Although I probably won't use this again. I used a whole box and I probably used too much because I never usually do this on my rugs, but also my dog sleeps in my room, like right in front of that tall dresser where she has a dog bed. So I just like to use this, but next time I think I'm just going to make my own, put some essential oils in regular baking soda because I had a headache for like a week from the smell of it. But if fragrance and stuff doesn't bother you, this stuff is awesome. It's like the pet refresh and I just let it sit on the carpets and then I gave everything a really good vacuum. I wanna drive a faster car I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes Try not to hold me down, feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars, I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me, no, no, nothing can break me Nothing can break me. I get so caught up in the middle, thinking of drowning in those blue eyes. I'm losing sight because I am far. Now that all of the vacuuming is done, I am just taking that same method wood cleaner and I am cleaning all of the baseboards and all of the woodwork around like the door frames and the doors. I was, again, really surprised because this is something, I mean, this is one of the kids' chores that they pick a room and do the baseboards and clean it. And I do clean them too, like spot clean them when they see that they're dirty. But I will show you on this next clip how dirty they really were and how dirty my cloth ended up being. Like, that is so gross. So I guess I have to do a better job of cleaning the baseboards. I cleaned all of the windows just with a rag and Windex. I am just putting all of the curtains back up because they were done drying. The bathroom curtain was very easy to do, but it took me five or six tries, I believe, to try to put up the ones in my bedroom because there was two different size rods and I figured it out for the first time, but then by the time I got into the second window, I had already forgotten and put all the white sheer curtains on the longer rod and the purple-ish color ones needed to be on the shorter rod so but i eventually got them up and i ended up putting them up wrong my husband came home and he's like why do those look wrong because i had them wrong in the little hooks and grooves so they weren't sitting up there right and one actually fell down and hit me on the head but all is well they are fixed now and actually like i said before i do have new curtains that are put up which I just love just changing such small things in your bedroom such as like just the color curtains those white curtains are still up I just got navy blue curtains and that's just as you guys know my favorite color and I use it in pretty much all of my decor there's some blue throughout my entire house I just love it but um it's just crazy how much it changes the room and just changes like the whole look of everything those curtains 
literally cost me $10 from the Christmas tree shop and it made a ginormous difference because I really don't know what to do with these windows in my room. So I just said I will change up the color of the curtains and call it a day. And I really love the way it turned out. Talking to each other, I know we feel the same about the situation. Like we're stuck inside a game. Time to get out of this circle. Yeah, we both carry a scar. As you write the part we're playing, time to cherish who we are. The only thing I ever wanted starts with us taking the chance. Not like anything we've done before. Oh, oh, yeah. So now the last thing that I am going to do is just wipe down everything in my bathroom. I'm going to clean out the sinks. Underneath my sink is fine and already cleaned out. I don't have much under there and it's already organized. So I'm just wiping everything down, cleaning all like the ledges in between the top of the vanity and the bottom part. And now I'm just going to do the same around the toilet really clean behind where we keep our toilet paper and my toilet brush, the cover to that, I think because we've been opening the windows a lot, had such a film of dust all over it. So I'm gonna wipe, see, it's just gross. So I'm gonna wipe all of that down and empty the trash and then we will be all done. All right, so that is it for this video. We got our whole bedroom and bathroom all clean for the spring and like I said there's definitely some things that I need to do more often than spring cleaning so I hope you guys enjoy this video I have a whole spring cleaning series on my channel I'll have it linked down below if you like to watch the playlist and I also have um, the kids spring cleaning of both of their bedrooms coming next week for you guys as well because that took me all day so that was a big project in itself but like I said I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do I hope you consider subscribing and sticking around and hanging out here on my little corner of the internet so I'll see you guys next time bye